let's go right into zinc. I think probably number one after vitamin D is zinc. All right. And I didn't have any zinc at home um, because my husband and I both love oysters. Oh, wow. And oysters, like two or three oysters, will give you 15 milligrams of zinc, which is the RDA. Mm -hmm. But if you felt like you were getting sick, you could double that. So you could go from 15 to 30 milligrams. And that would really help to go ahead and give a boost to your natural killer cells a lot of your white blood count that's gonna help uh, regulate again, basic immune functions. So I have to ask you about Zycam. Mm, sure. Is that a good supplement to take, even though it's not a supplement, it's sort of like if you have a cold, people take it to charge. Sure, you can use cold. that. I think you know it's good for people just to have in their wellness pharmacy, uh -huh. some form of zinc so that when you do feel like symptoms coming on, that's a great time mm -hmm. to start adding zinc, like zinc lozenges. Okay. Which you can find, you know, they come in like all, all different kinds of flavors and you usually get about five milligrams like in maybe one of those lozenges. Mm -hmm. Just sucking on that, particularly with anybody who's got respiratory issues, that will help to go ahead and coat the throat, mm. you know, and improve just the absorption in this particular region, which is where we really want to protect ourselves, right. you know, the lungs. So also if you wanted to put that zinc into a spray bottle and you could just spray it on the back of your throat, that would also help to improve the absorption. You could do that several times a day or just use the zinc lozenges. That would be great. Well, can we take it even though we're not feeling any symptoms? You know, most of us are probably doing okay with zinc. So if you, you know, or somebody that likes most seafood, okay. um, this is some ground beef that's okay. going to be super high. Any of your red colored meats like lamb are, mm -hmm. are going to be super high in zinc. Um, oysters I mentioned, you know, right. two of these you get. How about shrimp, lobster can? You know, they're not no? super high, but I think again, if you were, if you <laughs> were feeling the first set of symptoms, the CDC uh, right. suggests start with your D and start with your zinc. If you okay. get those two right away, you can actually abort some of the more classic symptoms exaggerating and extending okay. on like the flu symptoms. Okay, good to know. Jeannie, is there a website our viewers can refer to to just get more information about what we talked about today? Oh, sure. Um, it's the Nourishing Wellness Medical Center, so www.nourishingwellness.com. And uh, we'd be happy to answer any questions. So people can just go ahead and send a question if you're interested, and I'll be glad to answer it for oh, you. Oh, how convenient. Thank you. you and bet. thank you for being here today. Thank you. I to very, totally enjoyed oh, it. Oh, I had such a good time. You're very <laughs> welcome. And don't forget to check out elsegunda.org for all the latest and accurate information on COVID-19.